guys and welcome back i'm poked on paul and we're here with another episode of our 1212 ad campaign as the empire of trebizond or as we changed in the last episode we are now the byzantine empire and what comes with being known uh being the byzantine empire well you get no name but your capital does move to constantinople so that's that's always a positive but um the aim of this uh, uh this episode is really just to finish off the kingdom of thessalonica um, probably take out the Empire of Nicaea and um, maybe take out the Turks. I'm not really sure. I, it would be nice to get rid of them. Um, Bulgaria maybe as well, but I don't know if we'll have time to take all these factions out in one episode. If you guys do want to see me uh, sort of expand the Empire borders, then I will do so. I'm definitely going to get rid of these last two rivals. If you want me to take everything else um, and sort of get the uh, Byzantine Empire back to some sort of like normality then uh, please do leave a like comment uh, that you that you want to show that for support and uh, subscribe if you're new around here um, so what can we do I guess we just probably end the turn um, we have another assigned skill for this chap the governor so we'll put in some authority and we'll put in some uh, where is he? he's governor for Trebizond so we'll put in some more authority because this needs public order oh no he's not he's governor for here but still same problem. So let's see what happens. Will the Latin Empire come for Trebizond as it is doing here? If it, it does, then it's going to be a very starved and uh, depleted force, and that's fine with me. Here comes the Kingdom of Hungary. I don't. My new ally. Yep, we that's fine. Croatia, we can have some sort of non-aggression pact. I Serbia, accept. yeah, military alliance, whatever. Probably should have forced you to pay for it, but hey. Okay, they look like they're going to try and go for Constantinople. So that's not on. <laughs> and the Turks have risen up here in Ankara. We'll have to put them down again. Um, so the army from Trebizond can now move back. Um... God damn Turks, <laughs> such a big problem. Um, we're going to have a lot of problems with Simon Anatolia right now. Uh, and those guys that we're at war with. And some rebels that are now in Malatya. Well, that's rude of them to turn up there, but we'll deal with them in time. Uh, loyalty secured, perfect. And that guy's... Okay, lots of loyalty secured. Um, I could put these guys down first. I think I might. The Turks, I don't think, will be that major a problem yet. Yeah, let's just kill this guy off. Aggressive. Stab him in the face. Lovely, jubbly, dead. Yeah, hold that neck, which isn't attached to your head anymore. Perfect, right. You can then force march to there. You can put the rebellion down there next turn. And we'll put some morale in, and we'll put in integrity. Um, you can get an upgrade as well, so we'll put in some, I think some authority and maybe, um, what does cunning and stuff do? It's going to cost, um, I'd like some zeal, yeah, stop this guy from getting murdered, that's perfect, right, good, 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 right, let's see, what else can we do? Snope can get a lot of stuff, but that's not going to help, well, that one might help with public order. So we could do that. I think I might. Um, I'm gonna put. I'm gonna actually route this um, Latin Empire force. Right. Um, then you move into Constantinople. Perfect. Right. Um, garrison here. There is a garrison, but it's just catapult. Okay. Um, you're having a tavern built. Um, what else do I want? And you're going to have a basilica. So we could just put it in something like a... Oh, that's it. I was going to put in a Proinori's palace. Or however you pronounce that. That palace, anyway. Put in the palace. Philippos needs a lot of stuff converted. So we'll convert this to a walled city. Um, actually, what have we got here? This is already a walled city. Hmm. I'm going to make this a... Fort actually. I'm gonna make that fields. Yeah, that's fine. You need stuff built here. Town barracks. 
Don't really need town barracks. Convert you to an artist artist studio. Um, we could. What's the garrison like here? Oh, this is good. Oh my gosh, these guys have Templar knights. That's a good garrison. I don't need to know about that. Thank you. Get rid of that. Thank you. Um, I'll put it under siege. Some guy died that I didn't need to know about. Oh my god, yeah, I didn't think this would be easy. So they got foot chevaliers, they're good. Sergeants, Templar knights. A lot of crossbow men at arms, so we'll put it under siege. Um, I have a feeling I'm probably going to have to retreat instantly. Um, and it's a few... Well, actually, let's kill you off. Let's just... And then I could possibly force march to... Thessalonica with this army. We'll have to see. Uh, just take the warriors. Um, and then how far can you reach? Constantinople. Easy. No, I didn't think so. Alright, well you just do that then. Constantinople's not going to revolt anytime soon. That'll be fine. Um, you get that. And then zeal. And then we can move down to integrity. That'll be fine. Right, so we've done that. Um, you're recruiting a very small piddly army, which isn't going to do anything. Um, put in some spears. Right, that's good. And then, I don't think there's much else we can do. Kaffa has an army. But it's like a pretty awful army, which we don't really care about. It's just there to garrison, keep this place happy. And it's actually going positive now, so that's good. Right, um, I'm going to... Ooh, any mercenaries? No. Damn it. Um, certainly going to try and finish off roads. I think that's doable. Maybe with this army. Maybe we we'll have to be with one of the armies over here. Um, oh, we have no equipment and we're besieging Thessalonica. Right, we'll do that first. Um, and that's how confident I was that we're going to take it. <laughs> that I didn't even put any equipment in. Um, a ladder, please. Besieging the settlement. And then skills for Isaacius, who's governor here. Um, he can have... I don't know, have some personal influence with a decorated sword. And have conical helmet, because why not? You're probably not going to need them, but hey. And then do that. Uh, some extra tax and some extra public order. Trevisan's definitely going to rebel before this, uh, before he gets leveled up enough. But we can deal with that when it happens. Let's see whether anything happens in this end turn. Still not found many of the western factions, but I mean, I guess that's what comes from living basically in Anatolia and not having many trade routes and many people hating you. Bulgaria is actually not wanting to fight, so I may not actually go to war with them. Can I get any money out of you? I can. Let's try uh, 1,550. 1050, yep, yeah, they're just gonna, actually, they're killing off, um, the Latin Empire for me, which I can't complain with, so, yeah, they may be just a faction to keep around, it would be nice to push the border back to the Danube, but, don't want to keep this, uh, series going on longer than it necessarily has to, we've reformed the Byzantine Empire, there's not much else left to do, here comes Thessalonica, Right, I'm going to pull back because I'd rather fight with both the armies. Um, yeah, you're well out of range. And he's going to take Philippos this turn as like that. So, that's actually not the end of the world. Um, because I can now siege him in Philippos. Okay, they've taken the time. Faction destroyed, that an empire's gone. Kiev is also gone. Snope is under siege, that's fine. Um, we can just do that. Put them down. The Bit worried the Turks are getting strong, but we can deal with them. Take on warriors, stab him in the foot. Excellent. Stab him in the neck. Very dead. Perfect, right. Now you can go after the Ottoman rebels and kill these guys. Ah, uh, they're out of range. Damn it. Um, we'll leave you. We'll leave you in Ankara. Saves you the trouble of being ambushed. Um, 
we'll put in some recruitment costs and campaign movement range. Perfect. Right. That's been dealt with. I can now siege down this guy at Philippos. So we'll do that. And you can siege down Thessalonica. Um, siege towers. Thank you. I really could do with some siege equipment. But hey, we'll we'll get what we can get. Uh, yeah, there we, we go. Perfect. Right. So this is now a whole lot better. Philippos will probably fall very very shortly. Uh, it's not another army being built. Yeah, there is one down here in Smyrna. Not much I can do about that. Uh, we have a lot of money. I'm gonna spend some on a tavern here. Where's a tavern? Tavern. Perfect. And hot springs. So that should like push this place through the roof in food, uh, well not food, but in um, public order. Food is actually not going to be okay. We will need to upgrade that. Okay, you need to remember to do that. Um, I could actually probably do it now with some expensive uh, diplomacy, as I like to call it. A bit of expensive diplomacy. Anyone want some of that? Maybe you? Welcome. Let us talk. Arrange Let marriage, offer a daughter when we have agreement. for... A governor? Yeah, why not? Have go on. Not too fussed about it at this point in the game. Uh, seven. Yes, seventy-five hundred or seven thousand five hundred, like a normal person would say. Um, cow shed. There we go. Sorted. And we could then put in mosaic art. And I see it is just about over the edge of being happy, so I won't be fiddling around with that. Malat yet? Is snow? Yeah, it's okay. Just repair everything there. Um, you're nearly sorted in happiness here, but we've not quite got that sorted, so we'll sort it out soon. You're positive. We'll put in another, like an upgrade, so that will now be a butcher shop, so that's plus four in public order. Um, and that's kind of it, because we've lost Philippos, which I could have probably expanded and done some stuff. Commander. Oh well. Recruiting mercs? No. Um, I guess we just recruit some more stuff. No, we can't afford it. Oh well. In the turn, Thomas, who's a governor, don't want to give him any of that really. You can have public order and cunning. So you can start going down that tax. Perfect. End the turn. I don't care about this Trebizond pretender guy. It's very bizarre that this keeps happening. But oh well. We won't worry about it too much. What is Hungary doing then? Is Hungary going after Rhodes? I think it is. I'm going to have to send that small army and see if Hungary will help me out. Um, non-aggression. Yes, but only if you give me lots of money like that amount. Yeah, that's fine, a thousand. I'm strength ranking one, finally. No, I'm not joining that war. The U-bits aren't even doing any damage to the Crusaders, so why would I help fight you? You're just asking for a fight. So the plan is, is to let Hungary siege down Rhodes for a turn. Then I'm going to send my army to navally invade and attack. Here they come. Are they going to attack? No, they're just going to put it under siege. Noble birth, Diogenes. Trebizond is going to rebel. A lot of rebellion problems now. Right, let's just kill them off. Take on warriors. Kill these rebels. Execute. Perfect. And now, how badly... You're not rebelling too bad. You're going to rebel very soon, so we'll just put you outside. Ready and prepared. Uh, repair all this. Repair, 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 repair. Lovely. Um, Dora Leon. No, can't do anything. Philippos, you can just execute this guy here. Yep, stab him in the back. That's what he gets for defying us. Now they're without an army. That's a pretty battered army now, though. Only problem. The only problem. Um, I could knock this all down. I might just repair it. It's annoying that we're having to do this because I've just tried to do this like a minute ago. 
And there's been a massive pause, a fr freeze. A bit worried. Okay, that was very weird. I was about to cut, but then it sorted itself out. So we should be okay. God, I'm going to hope we are okay. <laughs> um, right, let's put in... I forgot what I was putting in here. I'll put in a fountain, I guess. I'm not really too fussed. Um, let's just put in... Let's make you integrity higher and... Um, I guess authority. Not too fussed about the rest. This is... Oh no, this is that army. I was getting a bit worried. Uh, okay, it's not as badly beaten up as I thought it was going to be. Replenishment. And then you can also have... Uh, morale when laying siege should be pretty handy. I'm going to put integrity in again. So that's going to put that integrity through the roof. Through the roof. Through the roof. If I can speak properly. Um, let's see what it's looking like here. It's looking slightly positive. We'll uh, keep that for another turn going. Um, okay, let's see if we can recruit any mercenaries. We can't. I'm going to just stay off the edge of the map here. Off the edge of the map. Off the edge, uh, just here in Rhodes. Hope that uh, Hungry Lands lay sieges to it this turn. And then we uh, sneak in next turn and take it with the support of the Hungarians and knock out Rhodes. That is the plan anyway. Constantinople, um, you can put in a, well, we're going to lose a lot of food in a minute here, yeah, 25, when that's done, that's going to take a lot of our food, so I'll put in a cattle herd, that will sort out that problem, and there we go, we will be sorted, and again, I don't know why I need to know about Rustam, a rebel leader dying, I should just click on it and get rid of it instead of it coming up here. But anyway, guys, I just want to thank you all for your support um, with the likes, subscribes, and the comments. And Hungary has not done what I hoped it was going to do. Thanks, Hungary. Unreliable ally. Yep, so we're going to pull back. And that's not the direction I was hoping you were going to go. So we're probably going to lose this army. Hungary, god damn it! <laughs> Alright, so we die. So we lose some guy in command, but it's not anyone important, so who cares. So we'll build up a bigger army. I might have to send one of the other smaller armies, but we can deal with it. Smyrna, we'll just we'll build another small one in Smyrna and start doing stuff. Um, oh, God. <laughs> George is uh, at war with the Ayyubid Sultans. I guess we have to join the war with the against the Ayyubids. Um... I think Georgia attacked the Ubids, or it could be the other way around. I don't know. An offer of peace from us should not be. Spent. Yep, I will make them my vassal. Go on then. Um, so Thessalonik is now my vassal. Um, I can't complain with that. That's fine with me. Um, let's just kill these guys off. Stab them in there. Lovely jubbly. It does allow me to send my main armies now down to go and destroy. Um, Whoever it is. Who, who is it? Nicaea. I've forgotten about Nicaea for so long. Um, Walkers of the Way. Um, let's make it... Hmm. I want this guy in charge, actually. This Michael. We've got two Michaels, but I want this one. Because he has integrity. Faction destroyed. Oh, Alexius is dead. We have a new king. Who's my heir now? Who is my heir? Ah, oh, Apollonior. This guy. The bastard. The bastard is my heir. Don't know if I'm okay with that, but hey, we're going to have to be. Um, Who... Should I just, for the jokes, just admit, adopt someone? Who's a general? Oh, you're a general. Let's adopt this... Uh, adopt this Michael. Make him... A son of mine. He shall grow into lots of... I don't know. He'll do something good, I'm sure. Um, right. I'm going to just hire 
reinstate the legacy, we'll put in Christophorus, reinstate the legacy, the companions. Yeah, you, Christophorus. Now do that. Now let's hire a load of troops. Preferably, uh, we'll put in some swords and we'll put in some archers. Oh my god, these guys are going to take air forever. Um, more swords then, and we'll put in some guard archers. That's like five turns, but I'm not really sending this army anywhere anytime soon now. We can recruit levies. Oh, nice. We can get some crossbow sergeants. Not that I'm going to need them. Um, I'll keep this army here in Philippos, um, and then you can move down to deal with... Are they actually getting better? Yes, but my guys are gold chevrons, so I'm not going to be changing them. Um, I'm going to move down to here. We're probably going to just kill the Principality of Achaia off, unless they're at war with, uh, allied with anyone. Yes, they're allied with Venice, so we're actually just going to go from there straight across to Rhodes. I don't really care about these guys. They can keep Greece. It's just a bit of rubbish anyway. Um, did they rebel? They did. Trebizond. Oh yes, the Ubids are now a problem. I forgot. So we better put this army into Garrison Malatya. Because the Ubids are now an enemy of ours. Which I don't want to have to really deal with. So we won't. Um, we'll just put in some... I could put in some really... Some of these guys. These are pretty handy. Uh, or just some swords. Or just nothing. There's nothing here I really want. Maybe those archers, but they're very expensive. Um, but we have the money, so why not? Let's put three guard archers in. They can stick there, stick around there for three turns. We can then... I don't know. Are the Crusaders who are attacking them? They are. They're taking Homs. Where's Jerusalem's armies? Oh. Maybe it is going for Cairo. Like, they, they got told to do in the uh, Crusade, like, ten turns ago. Or more than ten turns ago. More like 20 turns ago. So we'll take Rhodes, and then we're probably going to wrap this uh, episode up, and maybe the series. I don't think I'm going to have time to take out the Turks. And I've taken out all my, reb uh, all my rivals, so there's no real need to carry this uh, campaign on. It would also be nice to take the Turks out and get rid of them in Anatolia, but they're kind of doing that job themselves. They're just... They're not even sitting there. No, nice here. We're not having peace. I'm going to come over and destroy you. Here we go. This priest's going to do some dirty stuff. I don't know. Like, convert this place back to uh, Islam, possibly. Yeah, he's just got leveled up as well. God, good God. Georgia, I blame this all on you. Um... Give me lots of compensation. I don't know. Defensive alliance. Yeah, Principality of Antioch wants a uh, defensive alliance. You can have one. We're not going to hurt you. We're just going to run through your lands. I don't know. We're going to just be there. Right. Yay. This guy has been adopted. So we now have a really old guy in... As a, I don't know, as a child. <laughs> but who cares? It's funny. It's funny taking control of, like, people's lives. <laughs> oh, good God. It's going to take forever to get, get across. How many turns? One turn. Right, well, that's fine. Uh, we'll have some of these guys sword soon. Um, We could make this an, an inn. What's the food problem like here? Oh, it's... My, yeah, this will be fine. Um, in, sorted, Constantinople, you're getting happy now, so you don't care. Philippos, oh, we need to convert all this stuff. Oh, we're going to need some money, I forgot about this. At least the world likes me now. Oh, that's good. On behalf Only taken people, half the campaign. Welcome. Speak, friend, and honour us all with wit and wisdom. Right, that's high, perfect, right. Uh, you, no, that's still plenty of your money. Well, you really want to... Be, no, I've just just watched you say you'll give me three thousand coin. There, I'll have three thousand off you. Thank you. Right, let's convert this to a fort. Let's convert this to a field and that to other stuff when we have more money. 
the Byzantine Empire, it just doesn't look, this, it's just not right when you have no name. But Leon's the new king, at least his dad, got to have a little bit of time being the emperor. Give tongue to your words he would have enjoyed I'm sure he enjoyed it. Pisa's just a load of Welcome. rude people. Let us be by your right, there we go. And hi, and that's still hi. These guys really like want to be in a defensive alliance now. Sicily were one of the most annoying people trying to get an alliance, and now they're all over it. A tavern here, and... Yeah, I'm gonna need more money for a goddamn ass studio. It's gonna take Be forever. Welcome. Let us talk and then enjoy good Roman military access. We have agreement. Just give me that for thirteen hundred. I know you will. I'm more than that, eh? I don't really need more money, but there. Thank you. Right. Thank you. This is one way I'm gonna fund my empire. There we go. We're sorted. Um, and any mercenaries, any mercenaries. Well, we just got those Georgian spears, so that will be a yes, I'm sure. No, damn it. Um, could we recruit any more? No, they're going to take four turns. Well, guard archers will be fine. We're going to have a lot of archers in this army, but who cares? Um, two cavalry would be perfect for this army. It's kind of like pretty balanced. Um, Trebizond, yeah, no one cares. It's nearly over. We don't care. Uh, end the turn. Let's just go and kill Nicaea off. We have plenty of money now. I could probably bri bribe the Ubids to actually just leave me alone. I don't even know what they did, but it's not going to affect me anytime soon. They've not got any armies nearby that I'm scared of. They've got about probably seven units in that around... Uh, not, it wasn't Aleppo, it was somewhere else. Uh, yeah, sure, Croatia have it. These people just ask me for stuff. Just just take it now. Unless it's Constantinople. Then I will not give that to you. The Cumans, I, they were a problem for like two turns. Oh, the Ayubids are leaving their country. Well, not their country, but their border. Dair Bakir, or however you say that. That was a, definitely a butchering of the name, but hey, who cares? Maybe the anyone that's around from around there they'd probably actually be offended but oh well does it look like the Ubids have just exploded just quite yet they've got pretenders just now i think thessalonica's been destroyed uh decree it god damn it hungary well i don't care I'm not too fussed i don't even want them as an ally or a vassal. Oh well. Um, let's put you like here, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna do what I was gonna try to do earlier. Um, right, we've encounter encounter all these people. Very nice. Uh, can't hire any mercenaries. What a shame. Um, where's that other army? It's here. You're pretty happy on your own. I'm gonna put in some hot springs to make you happy. You're happy on food. Gonna be probably happy on everything else, but who cares about that? Have the costs, put that up. Nicaea. Uh, we don't really need anything here. Well, that year has got an upgrade, so we'll put in a, a potato. Help with that. Damn, I'm a bit annoyed about losing Trevor's. Uh, not Thessalonica. Only a little bit. It was nice just having them as a. A cheeky little ally, or uh, vassal. Speak for my people in our dealings. Yeah, I'm not too fussed, um, actually. Looks like the Ubids, they've occupied a place that's supposed to be desolate at the beginning of this game, but that's quite funny. Um, right. I'm just going to end the turn, I think. Oh, okay. Um, have that and tax. There we go. End the turn. End the turn. Get me nicer. Be nice to have hired some crossbow Templar crossbow men. They'd have been so handy. It also looked very weird in my army, but that's why it would have been good. The more weird, the better. Yep, hung and uh, Bulgaria. I hope you're happy with yourself. You killed off an innocent little vassal. 
They were my vassal. But it doesn't make it okay. And now someone go and kill off these guys here into Brits. Because they're really annoying. And they're also just very much undefended. Kill this small faction that right now. Oh, it's those guys, Volnia or whatever they're called. Or whatever their name was. They're, they've got some pretty big stacks. <laughs> I have to deal with them. Oh, I don't care. Encourage dissent all you want, man. Like, we've got an army in here. Um, What can I do? Is there any of these that I can, like... Ah, persuade. That's what I want. And I'll put another one in there. So then I could go and persuade this guy. Manipulate agent. Persuade. Carefully chosen words are as powerful as any. Damn it, didn't work, but at least he didn't die. Um food consumption. I could do, but I'm not too fast. Um what's the, the happiness look like it? Religious differences. Uh go on then, let's put it in. What's it called? An icon free at Iconography Studio. Wow, what a name. I like it. Yeah, just attack Rose from there. Uh, put it under siege. Wow. Is the supply so bad that it's got to take two turns? Um, you're going to take two turns to get all those guard archers. I really should brought the other army from Philippos. This is only a 19 stack. I lost a man. No! That's annoying. Where did I lose a guy? Oh, one of these spears. Damn it. That's that's a bit annoying. Um, just force march to there, I guess. And march some more. Um, build some baths, some baths. That's very annoying, actually. Um, and you've got all this. Wow, this is a good army now. <laughs> So many archers, so many, I mean, we've got some elite Georgian swords. Uh, yeah, I can't really complain. I could probably, I don't know, I don't know what their army's like. Did they take Homs? They did not take Homs. What the heck are they doing? What's Jerusalem doing with its armies? Um, yeah, this army, well, Rose is just going to be stocked full of troops. Um... Well, this may be a battle that we have to fight, but I think we could win it if we had to. Oh my gosh, so many guys that have... Flip it, right, just do that. Fine, one. We'll execute some defenders. <laughs> or, or some people. Uh, governor, just do that and tax. Thank you. Yep, the brothers in arms have been uh, decimated for like the fifth time in this game. I'm sorry, but you've got nothing to do. You're just there to defend Kaffa. Even though you're not needed anymore. The Cumans are gone. It would be handy actually to bring your militia units just to like become meat shields to assault Nicaea. Peace treaty. Our war has brought bloodshed, but without gain or progress. Nah, you wouldn't do anything like that. No. Clear off. Yep, they're not even going to attack us. Excellent. It gives us the time to get up our stuff. My lord offers you peace. Yep, we'll take it. I don't want to be at war with you. Get out of my lands. Um, the last thing I want is war with the Ayyubids. And I don't care if they kill the Crusaders off. Because this campaign's nearly over. And I don't need their money anymore anyway. I've got Constantinople. And I can just go to the west and trade with them now. They're just going, traveling all the, all the way up just to take the random settlements. Just a waste of time. Right, decimated those guys a bit. Perfect. Um, right. How far can they reach? Oh, they can reach a long way. Blade to mercy. Go into the sea. Kill these guys off. <laughs> Look at that. Peace negotiated. Nobody. A oh, Ubid Sultanate. Uh, <laughs> yes. Oh, it's so annoying. I hate that they haven't put that in. Um... I guess campaign movement, that's for ships. I don't know if all navies yet. I don't really care about that. Let's put in some sawmill stuff. Um, roads. It's sort of ready, but it's sort of not. I actually probably could have assaulted with nothing. Uh, I could wait. I'll wait one more turn for those guard archers, I guess. 
Oh, you can get some mercs. Can you get those mercs? No, you can't. Oh, I would have been half better if you got them because then you would have made a 20 stack. And my OCD wouldn't have been triggered. There we go. Just take some cheap swords. Well, not even cheap, but those swords. Just take them. Just take them. I won't look at... I won't complain. I definitely will. But hey. Right, that's fine. Um, put that in. We'll put in a meat market as well. Don't really need the food here. Um, Philippos, yeah, whatever. Snope. Making a lot of food for us. Very nice. Um, yeah, there's nothing else I really need to do. I'm just going to end the turn and we're going to just quickly mop up roads. And then we can call it a day. Good to see Nicaea skipped us and didn't do anything. Don't know what Jerusalem's doing, just seen them move a load of stuff, but not too fussed. So many factions to get through. Um, but we'll see what happens. I don't know if I will, don't know if we'll play another 12-12 campaign after this. I know I plan to do so. I may change up. I think I may be doing um, a Rome 2 Divide et Imperi. Impero won next. Uh, I don't care about Armado. Who cares? Oh, alright. Romanos is dead. Um, Snoke, you just put in a pate. I'm not even going to... don't even really care, but... Have it. Um, so put you there. You can come on Force March. Can you just... Yeah, we'll do that. We'll just assault uh, an aggressive. Kill these guys. Yes, right. Uh, occupy, please. Ready for Thank you. Right, so there we go. At an end. Oh, don't have the. Oh, don't have the money. Damn it. <laughs> um, just put in like I don't know. Verona. I just just. For, I'm not even really gonna probably play this again. But hey, I, I just want. Waste. I just want it to look nice. So there. Thank you. Now I can rebuild everything, knowing it's all nice. Uh, just have that and have that. Why not? Uh, have that. Have. Eh, have that. Have that. Thank you. Uh, oh, you need upgrading. Uh, have that and have that. Have. I don't know. Have that and have that. There we go. Right. Perfect. Well, guys, there we go. We destroyed the Empire of Nicaea. Uh, we have completed. Our aim of retaking the Byzantine Empire and destroying all our, all our rivals like the Latin Empire and their vassals. Um, I know we didn't destroy this one, but they, they become our friends and that's fine and we don't care about that. Oh, no, they have been killed off by Epirus. Epirus is sort of a rival, but they're not really challenging for the throne and I don't really want to have to fight them. They're not. There's no need to fight them. And then again, they've become quite friendly towards us. And we've got most of the, uh, the Empire back. It actually kind of looks like what... The Byzantine Empire starts to sort of look like by the end of its time. It's just sort of clinging on to Constantinople and the bits around that. But anyway, guys, if you've enjoyed this campaign, please leave a like and subscribe, and uh, leave a comment if there's any. If you want me to do another 1212 campaign and you suggest a faction, please let me know. I may be taking a bit of a break from it, but I will probably come back when there's maybe been some updates and some tweaks. Um, there will be more 1212 battles, but uh, maybe not a let's play for a little while. But if you guys have enjoyed, please leave a like, like I said. And uh, until next time, Legionnaires, bye for now.